Hi, this is Connor Dombrowski. This is Brainerd International Raceway in Brainerd, Minnesota. Driving my Lotus Elise 06. Running race slicks. No other mods, really. No power mods, no suspension mods. This is the pit area. I'll just uh, kind of fly through here. You know, pit, out, pit out is about three quarters of the way down the front straight. This will be, this first lap is just a warm up lap, and then we'll do a little bit quicker lap. This is through turn one. Turn one is uh, banked. You can run it flat out, no problem. It's very, it's very intimidating at first, but it can easily be taken flat out. You just have to build up to it. Turn two is a little fast sweeper. Nothing really mystical about it. Standard, standard corner. Take it pretty quick. Coming up to turn three. This is heavy braking at a faster pace. Nice late apex for um, turn three. Short straight between three and four. Four, you're going to want to stay to the left. So you take a very late apex on four. Stay to the left, set up for turn five. Now while I'm driving this a little deep into five, uh, Gary Curtis, race car driver, has told me that you, in five you don't generally want to get that deep. Turn six. Pretty standard. Uh, and this leads up to 7 8, which is a pretty critical complex. You try to carry some speed through here. Stay very left for 8, come in. That's not deep enough. You want to get those tires over on the rumble strips there so you can carry more speed through it. 9 is kind of scary because of the bridge there, but you can take it pretty quick. It's the same as 2, actually, but it looks scary because of the bridge. We're coming up on turn 10, which is uh, a, a very deep corner that has a lot of runoff, so you can actually do a slight early apex on it and come really wide here. You've got a lot of track to work with. Okay, we'll build some speed, come down the straight. It's a very long straight. Uh, the least doesn't have a lot of pull, so it might be, I generally would hit between 125 and 130. If I got to draft anybody, I could crest 130, but for the most part, I don't think I ever broke 130. Uh, you can take this flat out. I did a couple times. You can hear the engine. I'm not really taking it flat out at this point. Uh, coming up to two. Now, I have, was shifting into fourth here, so I would have acceleration uh, coming out of four, but a lot of other cars can just stay in here. Coming up to three, heavy braking. I'm a little easy on it there because I was coming up on this uh, white 944. Gives me a nice point by. I'm just going to keep it in third so I can run right to the red line, get into the braking zone. Stay left, stay left. Take a late apex. Keep it left. Run in here. Turn six. This is the seven eight again. Stay left for eight. Come in. Go deep. Hit the rumble strips, which I missed at this point. Come up to nine. I learned later on that I should should have was well, we started to shift in the fourth earlier, kind of short shift because it was just too scary to try to shift and complete the turn. come up in the 10 again. I'm breaking a little early there. The Lotus can do it deeper, but uh, just really stick with it. Got a lot of track. Track out through turn 10, and it's back out onto the straight. That's it.